Okay. Outsider Survivor. I'm going to talk about bicycle. Uh, one person on a bike can run a horse to death. Uh, it's more efficient. We can go longer. And uh, there's, there's no more efficient mode of transportation on the planet than leg power on a bicycle. Uh, it's, there's nothing else that can get you further. Um, this just runs on food. When your car is out of gas or when it gets stuck in the traffic that piles up in a disaster scenario, uh, or if there's an earthquake and the roads are torn to pieces, your vehicle may not do you any good at all. Uh, there's a lot of things that can go wrong with a motorcycle, including its limited fuel, and they're heavy. Uh, if there's a road obstruction or a bridge collapse, you can't just tie it on a string and lower it down or pull it up once you've climbed up somewhere. Uh, but a bicycle you can do that with, and you can keep on going after you've done that. You can throw it on your, your back or just pick it up in your arm and uh, carry it over an obstruction that you can't get a motorcycle over. Uh, there's a lot of things that would that would stop you uh, in a disaster scenario. One of the example, an earthquake or a flood that shut most vehicles down. Uh, you know, even a sandstorms or ash from a volcano, those things, dust storms, they all shut vehicles down. Uh, but a bike, it only shuts down when you shut down. Uh, you know, it has things that can go wrong with it. So the more simplistic the bike, the better. Uh, having a low gear so you can go uphill if your region has hills uh, something you know all that depends on where you're where you are what kind of bike you get depends on where you are but leave the Lance Armstrong Tour de France bike at home those little tiny rubber band tires however efficient they may be uh, when there's broken glass and rubble all over the place it won't be long before you've got a flat then all that speed that you had from those ultra light super narrow rubber band tires uh, all that speed is lost and you know some BMX or with just knobbies and a mono gear is gonna roll right past you uh, because I mean think about when you were a kid did your old BMX bike ever have a flat I mean how often did that happen it never went down but uh, had a lot of a lot of nice bikes and uh, the uh, little racing bikes they had all kinds of problems when I was riding on the road run over some glass, a thorn, and they were done. So I suggest getting knobbies of sturdy tires. I know they make foam-filled ones. That would be awesome. Uh, I can't afford that myself, but, you know, that that would be slick. But get yourself a bike. Uh, one of the most efficient ways of getting around that there is. All right, Outsider Survivor, stay safe in the woods, and this bike will help get you there.